decorating with Barbara. You can do it. Hey guys. So in today's video, I'm going to share with you a quick haul from Home Goods and one item from Goodwill. And I also got one item from Pottery Barn. So I mentioned in a recent video that I was making over my study. And so that's where we are today. And so that's what this haul is about. Things that I purchased to go in my study. I wanted to paint the walls and as you can see the walls have been painted if you guys remember the study the room that had the silver um, chairs so many of you guys knew that I had a garage sale this weekend and I will insert a few clips of the um, items that I sold So after the sale, I made a little extra cash and I wanted to pick up a few items for this room. And my plan was to look at a picture. I wanted a fairly large picture for this wall. Or I had a small picture and two sconces on the side. So I thought if I could find a little larger picture, maybe I could get by without using the sconces. So for this room, I wanted to go with something a little cleaner, um, less fussy with a few masculine touches. I saw this picture and I thought it was perfect. I love the colors. It had um, the gray, some silver, and a little bit of brown. And then it had the cream. And then it appears like the cream has some sort of wash on top of it. And so I thought that was a perfect piece for this room. Those are exactly the colors that I wanted so to I use. I thought maybe if I step back a little bit, you can get a feel for how large it is. Now, after I got it home, it could have been a little larger, but I'm going to put the room together and then see how it looks with everything in place. You guys, remember I had painted those chairs silver like last Christmas. And so I wasn't necessarily looking for silver to be in the picture. And so I thought, let me see if I could maybe pull in some masculine pillows to tone down the silver um, in the picture and in the chairs. So that's when I found these large striped pillows in gray and tan. So after seeing the pillows here in the chair, I thought maybe I can use pillows with more brown. So I'm not totally in love with the pillows. I wish they had brown in them. I did see a set that would have been perfect the last time that I was in Home Goods, but I didn't get the pillows. And so when I went in yesterday, I looked for them, but I couldn't find them. So you guys know the saying, you snooze, you lose. Okay, so while I was in there, I picked up a throw because I thought the throw matched the pillows pretty nicely. It's a cotton and polyester blend. It's in a really nice size throw. It is, I think, 60, 60, 50 by 67, and it was $19. And it has a pretty fringe detail on the bottom and it is very soft. Okay, so another thing that I picked up that I thought would have a nice feel for this room was this vase. It's actually a utensil caddy. And so it was in a lighter gray, but you guys know me, I had to come home and do a little dirt wash on it. And so um, I wanted to make it a little darker and um, I think it turned out really nice. But I'm not going to use it on this side because of course I'm not putting utensils in it. So I picked that up and it may go in here, I'm not 100% sure. So I also picked up this vase because I thought it also looked nice with the picture. 
and I just like the detail on it. It has a little texture, but at the same time, it has a nice shiny um, sheen at the top, which I thought was pretty. Okay, so, well, I meant to start with the Goodwill item first, but since I'm here on the tray, one item I got from Goodwill, and that's the Mercury Glass candle holder. Now, I told myself that I was not buying any more Mercury Glass, but I couldn't help myself. It was only $2.99, and with Christmas coming up, I thought it would be a good purchase. Plus, I have a larger one that is exactly like it. So you need a pair, but for real, I am not buying any more Mercury Glass. Okay, so, oh, the tray. So I also picked up this tray. It's just a simple um, whitewashed wood tray and it has nice little um, rope handles. And it's a pretty nice size. And I think I may put this on, if I use it in this room, I'll use it on the desk. But some of these items might end up in the kitchen. Like this item here, I know I purchased it for the kitchen. It's just a small, simple tray with a wood bottom and a metal uh, rim. And I thought this would work near my kitchen sink. Okay, so the last item that I picked up, no, I have a few more. Okay, so down here, I picked up a candle, and I just like the container, but the fragrance is actually really nice. It is Rosewood Vanilla, and it is a soy wax candle, and I like the container, the fact that it had a lid, and the colors work perfectly with what's going on in my home for the fall. And then I picked up this little vase because I had been eyeballing that from Pottery Barn. But when I went back, of course, they only had the one small size. So I went ahead and got it. But this does come in three different sizes at Pottery Barn. I think the two larger ones have a different pattern. But I thought that was really cute. And so I picked that up. And then the last item that I got was a pair of curtains, which is what I went in for to begin with. And so I picked up these gray curtains because I thought it would also give a masculine feel to the room. And so, yeah, that's it for the haul. So I will come back hopefully this week on Friday and share the reveal. Okay guys, so I know you thought this video was over, but don't go anywhere. There has been a change. Okay guys, so after looking at this color palette here, something was just falling flat. Now, I know I wanted the room to have a kind of a cozy, more um, masculine vibe, but I wasn't sure about the gray curtains with my gray wall. I just thought everything on one side being gray might not cut it. So I went back to Home Goods and I found this combination, which I thought was very pretty as well. Similar colors, but what I added was this lighter cream tone and it has some taupe in it as well. So I thought I was missing the cream in this combination. I will be using cream in the bookcase as well as the wall here, but I didn't have cream on the window wall, so I thought I needed to bring cream in over there. You guys will see how it all shakes out in the reveal, but for now, just know I have choices. So I really like the pillow. I thought it said fall with the soft fur feel and then the throw is really pretty even though it is cotton it is a thick kind of a double-sided 
um, cotton. It, it has this peachy tone on one side and it brings in the cream and the brown. And then on the other side, it has more of the taupe with cream and the brown. So I think when I pull this all together with some other accessories, this might be the one I choose, but you never know. Stay tuned. Come back for the reveal because I think it's going to be beautiful. Now, oh, I also picked up these little candles that I thought were pretty. They had those sitting there at the checkout counter. So on the way out, I just grabbed two. I thought they were really pretty and would complement this look very nicely. So which vibe speaks to you more? Is it this one with the darker masculine colors? Or is it this one that still has a masculine touch but with a softness as well? Okay guys, so that's it for the video. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe.